bro, I got this bottle of lotion and I really need it for this flight I'm gonna catch, but man, I think TSA is gonna take it. Bro, just smuggle it. But where? Try your shoe. Nah, they make us take those off. Oh, uh, but... Put it in your jacket. Nah, I'm using this to smuggle my water. You can't just bury it in your suitcase? I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, you're right, man. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, this is ass, bro. Wait. She ate the f why am I up here? Go, 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 go. Always get that look like Darwin. <laughs> you better stop. stop. Why are you so <laughs> fast with all the <laughs> I would just like to thank everyone for flying spirit. The skies are clear and we should have a smooth flight. Everyone listen up! I'm taking over this plane and you are all gonna do exactly as I say. Damn. You, glasses, get, get, get up, get up. Stand in the back. But sir, please, I have a wife and three kids. Do it now. Is that lotion? Wait, wait, it's not travel size. It's not travel size. Run, this I is size lotion on a plane. Everyone listen to me and I won't open this. Freeze. It's okay, everyone. I'm an undercover cop. An armed one at that. Drop the lotion now. <laughs> You think that's gonna stop me? What? What are you doing? Nothing is gonna stop me! <gasps> are, are those full-size water bottles? We're doomed! We're all doomed! <laughs> Murder! Murder! There's a man on my plane with water bottles and full-size lotion! Help us! Help us! And that's why I can't let you take water on the plane. Can I at least drink it before I board? Get him! <laughs> Get him now! My diaphragm! How the fuck did we figure out how to fly? Like, like, nah, for real. Who took a Greyhound bus, slapped two wings on that John and an engine, and figured out how to make it go thousands of feet in the air? Like, flight is an amazing feat of humanity. But who did this? What? Oh, are we not stepping up? Oh, nah, y'all must think this is a game. Who designed these chairs? Y'all had no reason having bro on the team. These chairs are borderline disrespectful. Like, why go through the trouble of putting a recline button on a chair for it to go from here to here? Hey, yo, yo, you fly coach. Just get a first class ticket. Listen here. I don't care how much money I make. I'm not paying two bands for a chair that reclines. I'm not paying two bands. For a chair that comes with cup holders, for two bands, that chair better come with some bitch. I don't hate flying as much as I hate TSA though. I both hate TSA agents and pity them at the same time because they're rude, but I know they deal with some BS. And to do that five to seven days a week for eight hours, y'all better put some respect on them boys, man. Because you don't realize it, but they have crazy amounts of authority for real. Like, like, like imagine being rude to someone. I came looking for booty. Who has the ability to cavity search you? Like that's actually crazy like dead ass no pun intended they can do that and you can't say no that that's od i can't even get mad at tsa for granting their employees that level of power though i gotta get mad at the first person to sneak something in with their back door bro i got this bottle of lotion and i really need it for this flight i'm gonna catch but man i think tsa is gonna take it bro just smuggle it but where try your shoe nah they make us take those off oh uh but Put it in your jacket. Nah, I'm using this to smuggle my water. You can't just bury it in your suitcase? I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, you're right, man. I don't know. <sighs> yeah, this is ass, bro. Wait. Can you imagine checking someone's literal back door for something and not finding what you're looking for? Like, like what do you say after that? <clears throat> Sir, I'm sorry. We didn't mean to. Shh, nah, nah, it's cool. Honestly. That just made my whole week. TSA sucks, but the real problems happen when you actually get on the plane, especially if it's one of these budget airlines like Spirit. Man, those Motel 6 ass airplanes, bro. They make their planes out of aluminum foil. I'm telling you, they don't even need TSA. Like, for real, no one is hijacking a Spirit plane. One of these airborne Honda Civics could crash into a building 
and be the only thing damaged, bro. Let you hop in a spirit plane and get one slight gust of wind. Boy, that cabin finna shake so hard that you think the plane was flapping to stay in the air. Like, honestly, the pilot would be better off taking that plane on the highway and driving me to my destination. Like, I feel so much safer if that was the case. All I'm saying is, if you fly spirit, you better be ready to meet the holy one. Sir, we can't figure out why the spirit plane crashed, but we did find a trench coat filled with water bottles and a, a bottle of lotion. Lotion, you say? Hmm. Hey, yo, why does it smell like shit? I keep a four five like I'm on a bench, though. My nigga's shredding out because I said so. I got a laser. That shit came from Petco. Bitch, get that pen. I'm a ride in my death note. You don't want smoke. No rap shit, I make the kitty go crazy like catnip Keep it a bean, I don't do all the capping I'm making money, you niggas make captions Look on my face though, I get the money I flip it to pesos, I got the Mac of the merch like queso Hit from the back, I'ma give her a halo you I'm in the field, I'ma give me a tractor Niggas know I'm real, I don't need a caption Bring to be bad like a motherfucking rapture Ready for action, just like I'm an actor I got a cat, me and that's with our city on the map I put my beam at your fitted and blast, blah